Hi, my friends. Welcome to Deep Six, the Deep State. ABC News today published a leak from the Inspector General's report that really absolves Trump of the charge of obstructing justice. Instead, it lays out the Comey's conduct uh, throughout the time prior to Trump's firing him was such that he was guilty of, and these are the IG's words, insubordination and failure to follow instructions by the Justice Department, uh, obviously grounds for firing him. So if these provide Trump with the basis for getting rid of Comey and the assumption that underscores the Mueller investigation, which is that he fired Comey to stop the Russia uh, collaboration and collusion investigation, goes up in smoke because there were perfectly valid grounds for, uh, for getting rid of Comey, in particular that he had been instructed by the guide, or should have followed the guidelines of the Justice Department and not made public announcements about the email case involving Hillary in the days before the election uh, and that uh, he had been told not to. And one of the people who's quoted in there is Rod Rosenstein, uh, who appointed Mueller and is in charge of this investigation, uh, which really ultimately exonerates Trump from the charge of obstructing justice. Now, the other pillar of the obstruction charge against Trump is doing just as badly. The assumption or the charge that Trump obstructed justice in February, of, uh, right after he took office, when he told Comey, I hope you can see your way to letting go of this matter, meaning Mike Flynn. Now, Comey has interpreted that to mean an instruction to obstruct justice. But the a legal memo written by Trump's lawyers a week after the inauguration showed that they believed and they told Trump and he believed that there was no investigation of Mike Flynn, that he had been exonerated already, that the FBI had interviewed him and concluded that he had told them the truth and that there was no basis for any disciplinary action against Flynn. So when Trump told Comey, I hope he can let the matter go. That was not obstructing justice because there was no justice to obstruct. So these two pillars, uh, the one pillar of the uh, Trump-Comey conversation about Flynn and the other being Trump's firing of Comey six months later, are the basis of the Mueller investigation. And now both of them have been knocked down. This is sponsored by the Patriot Gold Group. Um, if you follow the history of gold and oil, they move up or down in tandem. And with the increase in the price of oil lately, an increase in the price of gold, experts say, is very likely to follow. Last time there was a gap, gold caught up by going up $200 an ounce. And many experts predict that's what's about to happen. So call the Patriot Gold Group at the number on the screen or go to patriotgoldgroup.com. Thanks for watching.